I'm also curious to see if this Lina has the same impact as we saw yesterday. <laughs> With this dying breath, throws the blood grenade at you into death. Mira will kill him, but he'll die just the same to Ramses. Emotional problems on the team, communication, be their friend, whatever he needs. He's good, that's to a do good it. captain, y'all. Oh, Kiyotaka, if he gets hit by this, he's probably dead, but that fourth poison doesn't land. Oh, it does now land. it lands. Kiyotaka came back into it. Mira's not popping it just yet. Maybe he wants to land a fifth one just to ensure. Or maybe he wants to try and get five. Oh, both oh of my No way! <laughs> you monster, Mira! Yeah, fighting through basically two storm spirits. Oh, Mira's dead? Difficult. Mira, no! Okay, Kiyotaka. Get... Might have been a little bit late for that one. I guess they don't want to stack, they just want to take it. Yeah, this is some good support farming right here. Mm -hmm. The token! The token! Oh no! They lost their life and lost their token. Maybe both their lives. TP up at the LSA. No, a good blade. That's what they say. Second good angle. time's the charm. Very good angle. Pretty much perfect situation, but they still didn't want to go for it. They want the last hits. Immediate Shadow Dance. They do not feel good about this one. Looks like uh, Solo. Oh, Dragon Slave long range. Laurel really wanted to snag the last hit. Meanwhile, Ravage being used here on the top lane. Ramses perched up as well. Stop that TP. That's the kill I thought they were going to do. Because we Are they that broken? I mean, for a hero that doesn't have a stun, probably. He just loves him. Got the Fiend's Griff off, and that did take away all the mana oh. from Laurel. Laurel, the Decrepify on him. Thank God they had the change on Decrepify. Disruption going to be used. That, that just leads into the... Ooh, okay, never mind. They actually had enough. Turn around. Kiyotaka's going to be the one who dies. Laurel zips on through him. Very low. Heal a little bit. Oh, oh it's not enough. Oh, he's oh. past his oh. axe. It's not quite enough either. Solo. The grenade. A blood grenade. The blood a grenade. Curse. A curse. He's dead. It's not enough. He's not dead. It's the not pipe. doing any damage. The pipe from Collapse off the kill top saves oh, him. Oh, no. The counter. Team Spirit talked about the blood grenade answer, <laughs> and it was Collapse with a pipe. Solo's been shut down. Nine pandas are crumbling. They absolutely are crumbling now. It's going to be 4,000 net worth lead as they get the final kill in that fight. Yeah, I would have thought Aghanim Scepter and, uh, you know, just again, get on top of the backliners, but they've got a different idea here, it seems, on Team Spirit. Miro, Global Silence, TP out, but the physical damage, the physical damage was the problem for him. Doesn't make I, me... I, I would not have thought of Radiance this game. I would have just thought of, like, Defusal Echo Ags, but, right? Yes, get on top exactly. of these range cores and shut them down. They will find Kiyotaka, and they will... Is that a Lotus Zap? They just chuck him down. No, I think they just bursted him. Early Lotus, though. That was uh, it's quite the pickup. I mean, that is the early oh, game that Mira had here. Yeah, the double kill on mid turns into a Lotus Orb. Powers. He gonna be there. Long skip over to be able to find Ramses. Dyer's top tower is under attack. And Solo may regret his TP. Laurel doesn't have too much mana to work with, but maybe it's just enough as Solo will not be able to outrun the watermelon running after him. Solo didn't even throw a blood grenade. Me neither. Found Kiyotaka again. They are just not dealing with the vision that's out in this game right now. Global Sound's going to be used once again. A TP that is denied because the damage without spells is more than enough for Team Spirit. Cool beans, no harpoon. Does it Toro know he's playing slug? Maybe he thinks he's Phantom Monster still. I, I think already half though, this is going fast. You can talk get here in time, I think. He has Ag Shard, this is his Lena Power Spike. Oh, it's a close call, they're taking a little detour. They gotta get in here now, the Roshan, it dies just in time. And now, Laurel straight into the fight. He goes with this Aegis, fearless in his initiation. Roared up immediately, but again, they don't want to target him. Ravage goes down to ensure the Beastmaster dies, but also on the back line. Ramses came through with his BKB, trying to get somebody. The Heaven's Halberd nice has completely disruptive. ruined his damage. Now, Baposhka to decrepifies himself. Ramses hardly getting anything done in this initiation. His entirety of his BKB wasted, not a single kill. 
get the Aegis. But that is it, and that is just more mana for Laurel to chase down the rest. Four man wipe off the back of that Roshan for Team Spirit. Just the utility. It's just the wealth pouring in for the Team Spirit supports. Paying off really hard in these early fights. Oh, but what about the Blade Bail? Ramses! What have you done? I got the Pugna. I mean, this is a three on five. Team Spirit just getting caught outnumbered here. Might get run down. Yeah, Collapse has got a long way to go to get home. Laurel's just gonna sit there and watch as the watermelon takes. No oh, he actually got close enough to the primal roar. That was a little dangerous. Fortunately, no follow-up stunts. He was able to zip away. What's wrong? <laughs> what do you want to? <laughs> oh, the chat is covering up the kill goal. There's too many chat wheels. I can't see how much just go kills are worth. <laughs> Nine hundred and twenty-four or something plus five hundred forty. Well, they'll return the favor straight on the mural. Pandas once or not, they're gonna three-man smoke straight into the ward from Maposhka, who breaks the smoke, sees them. Laurel immediately goes for the initiation he BKB. Shield rune. Sure, he got the Prattler Ward, but a shield rune plus the BKB. They can't do enough damage to him. He's gonna shrug off this Fiend's Grip, help go for the kills. Yotaro's already managed to finish up Kiyotaka. Looks like Miro did manage to get a kill out of this one. Meanwhile, back into it, Mira disrupted himself and stays alive until the Brain Tap finally managed to finish him off. It's gonna be a two for five. Never mind, Shadow Amulet, TP. Got him. Got him. Two for four. That's GG. game. GG. Just call it 28 minutes. Team Spirit demolishing. Nine pandas in this game three after getting over the hurdle in game two. This team, the team that will not go away, find another 2-1 series win, as is their quota. Off the back of just a very strong early game performance. I go back to Mira, the double kill in the early laning phase to cement the Shadow Demon net worth going into those fights. The utility from Team Spirit definitely giving MVP to the Shadow Demon and the Skelly Boy here on the Poshka. The Decreps, the Purges, making Ramsey's life unlivable. This Wind Ranger didn't get anything done. He's playing into way too many counters here. There's nothing else to fall back on. This mid-magic damage Lina's cool, but it's not like a hard carry. It's like a secondary third option here. So Kiyotaka cannot put the weight of the world on his shoulders this time around. And Laurel shuts down the haters with a dominating 12-1-7 performance.